Peace and love to the world. How are you all doing? I'm doing so great. This is Golden Spiritual Teacher right here. And we are evolving every single day. I'm here to expand your mind, expand your consciousness with the right knowledge of self. Yes. So, the yogi knowledge says, only with the true knowledge, we can enlighten ourselves, we can free ourselves from all the pain and suffering here on planet earth yes so we are here to collect also the wisdom from all of our experiences so today what i'm going to tell you this is what's going to allow you to elevate more higher also expanding your mind and consciousness and heal you because only through right understanding we can gain the knowledge so now Please, before I dive in, share this video, share this video. I'm just sitting under a beautiful flower tree and I'm feeling great. Yes. So now, do you know how important it is to really express how you feel? Some people, they're holding their feelings inside. And that is what's creating lots of blockages in our chakra centers. You see, in my earlier videos we've been talked about chakras so when you want to express something and you don't expressing it just because you don't want the person to feel bad or you feel bad to express it but you need to understand to really express yourself fully so when you do it the energy flows flow easily through your spines through the chakras let's say that there is a person who wants to say something how they about how they feel and they are not they they cannot do it they don't feel okay just by expressing it because they fear that other person, the other being may say something and you start to fear. So you hold it in you. So that is, that is what creating blockages in your third chakra. And also another thing, if you start to lie, lie about how you feel, lie about yourself, anything, anything. It's also creating lots of blockages in your third chakra. Same way, is there any blockages in your sacral chakra the second chakra okay so now the second chakra is when you are not expressing your divine energy sexual energy you're holding back maybe there you are traumatized maybe also your creativity maybe you are traumatized and you are not fully expressing it it's creating blockages in your sacral chakra and root chakra it's also how we developed since we've been kid, how we've been raised, how we were, how, how much love we got from the parents, what about our shelters and the food, you know, how much materialistic, you know, uh, fulfillment we had when we were kid. So all these are created lots of blockages. So from now, we're just gonna work with ourselves to just say or do or feel exactly the way express it all but i don't say it like this while you can do whatever you want to do but you need to do the things that is coming from the purity of your heart something that divine wants you to do i don't i don't allow you to going around and doing wrong doing things but the right doing things that helps you to elevate more to enlighten more become the greatest version of yourself so now, instead of holding back about how you feel, instead of holding back all of these emotions and anger and, you know, guilt, whatever you carry, you need to express it. Guilt's creating lots of blockages in your heart chakra. So we are here to really fully express ourselves and really tell somebody about how I feel about the person or, or, or what I don't like, what I like, anything that you are holding back, you need to express it from now and you will see that you will create an energy that is gonna help you to elevate it, that is gonna help you to breathe more, drip deeper within in yourself, that's gonna clear up more of your mind and this is the most powerful tool that you can use in your daily life and also going out in nature, listening to the birds, breathing in this fresh prana, the chi, and also grounding yourself, drinking lots of water, eating lots of fruits. All of these are very, very important for each of us, all of us. We are here to be our authentic self, you know. Me, as being vegan, I am so authentic about how I feel, what I say, my movements, anything. Because I didn't come here to please anybody, but I came here to please only myself. So I'm going to make sure that I feel, I make it really comfortable for myself with the purity of my heart. Because I didn't came here to please anybody. I came here to 
just be my authentic self. That doesn't matter if there is people who bring hate on me, if there is people who bring, you know, loss of anger on me, or bad entities towards me, or bad thought current, or maybe talk bad about me. It's nothing have to do with me. It's all of their personal development. What I am responsible for, it's my action, my words, and my authentic self. You got me? So I'm here to just be me without thinking what the person may like or may not like about myself. So all I can do just be myself and do me for the rest of my day even though people don't like it. Let's say that I don't like something that is going on in this place and I will be like, no, I don't like it. You know, if, so, if I put a, a bottle of you know, water and I'm about to drink it. And is there, if there is somebody who's drinking it without my permission, I put that for it to, you know, um, for it to cool down, chill down. So if somebody else come and drink it without my permission, then I have the right to tell that person like, well, that water was mine. You should at least ask me before you drink it. So I was having it there for it, for me to drink it. So you're supposed not to drinking it. So. I told it, if the other person feel bad, I have nothing to do about it. All I can do is just be my authentic self. Same way in every situation in our life, guys. We need to just be ourselves and express our heart and mind fully. And just make ourselves feel good. Exactly right in the morning, drinking a glass of water, praying, giving thanks. Starting the day by giving thanks. Thanks to everybody. Even your enemies you should give thanks to. Even your friends, family that you are not with anymore. You got me? Family members that you cannot come together with, come along with. The friends that you left many years ago. I give thanks to each of all beings here on earth. Even the people that I don't know. I give thanks to Most High, the angels and spirits and everybody because when I'm grateful, I'm creating an aura of gratitude. Our car- body carry more than 70 persons of water. So now when I'm putting that vibration out, I am my body, that water is taking its own shape and form within me. So I'm going to feel more crystallized. It's all about me. It's all about how I feel. It's about how I'm elevating. It's all about how I'm enlightening myself in my daily life because this is spiritual war and we're in this world together and the war is actually with yourself. It's nobody else. You are in your mind and you are living your life with your mind. So how much struggle are you having with your own thoughts in your daily? You just want to get away from all these thoughts and you're like, oh my God, I cannot do it. Your thoughts gives you your own emotions because your emotions don't just come. First of all, please share this video. And the second of all, I'm just channeling in from the sky right there. This is the crown chakra. So now, um, what I'm telling you all is that, okay, so basically, hmm, when I'm thinking of something, that is what's giving me emotions and feelings. If there is no thoughts, there is no feelings. There is no feelings at all. You have to think of someone. You have to think about something, some situation in order to feel that anger, frustration, guilt, sadness, happiness, or joy. This is the truth. So, how can, how can, how come you want to have an empty, empty head? with no thoughts at all everything in this illusion everything is mental it's based on all of these thoughts even this is a thought even i am a thought my mind is a thought everything here on earth, all this materialistic world it's based on thoughts so everybody wants to get rid of thoughts everybody wants to get rid of how they feel right now and they don't want to feel it and they want to feel happiness insta- instantly it's like no first of all you need to organize your thoughts because thoughts are going to be here in my deep meditation practices you know there is no thoughts it's, do you know why because the, i don't have any attention or any focus on those thoughts i'm just fully in the present moment and enjoying my each of my breathing so this is the thing about having no thoughts yes so now without experiences there is no truth you need to experience it by yourself so now you know to liberate yourself you need to allow yourself to change your thought patterns thought current only by focusing on the on everything that is positive anything that is positive bring your thoughts into positive current positive frequency 
thinking of something good you can change it change it in just a second or when you meditate and you sit in meditation pose or trying with breathing techniques or mantras or any yoga posters you do it look i'm sweating every morning i do yoga so now so now the thing about it is that you know all this helps you when you meditate it helps you to focus on the breathing it brings you to the present moment the thoughts are still here so when you do yoga there is there is positive thought current that you create in your mind about yourself you boost your self esteem when you do breathing techniques you are clearing loss of um thought currents you creating loss of energy out of your mind just by breathing like pushing them out like pushing them out Yes, now you refreshing your mind, but it's all about you, your focus and attention. Wherever you are focus putting your focus and attention to, there it grows. These thoughts are growing. So you need to be very conscious about it. You can change it at any moment of your time, any moment of your life, even right now that I am talking to you, I am changing somehow because we are interconnected. So now you can change it any time that is why i've been telling you all express the way you feel change your thought current any moment that you want to make your life very simple and easy going make yourself very authentic and yourself because the people who supposed to love you going to love you exactly for who you are going to be with you exactly for who you are because you know deep down how pure you are you know deep down how pure you are Yes I'm talking to you. So, I love that purity shower you every single day. Remind yourself of that purity because the ultimate truth is that the soul, the observer itself, the immortal self who you truly are, it's purest essence of God, purest essence of love. So focus on that. Do not try to focus on the yesterday action, yesterday speech, yesterday violence. Okay focus on the present moment and give love to the people that really deserve your love and stay away from those people that 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 brings the energy out of you that makes you lose of energy losing your energy uh, allow yourself to spend more time with the people that helps you to elevate higher that energized your body energized your spirit and mind and soul yes don't be around in environment and people and things like that that allows you to lose your energy and then after some time you are just out of energy and you are sad or you are mad or you are some you are feeling down in energy and you are just looking around the trees and you feel sad like oh no stop having some time, times like this now is not the time to be like that no 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 it's not the time to be like that now is the time to shake your body shake your ass and dance and smile and and do all the creativity art music okay writing creating doing yoga meditation inspiring somebody in your family or friends or through internet you can do it we do know why from the very first beginning i have to tell you something about myself this is so beautiful from the very first thing the beginning of my this journey my spiritual journey as a golden spirit what happened nobody ever believed in me some everybody thought that i was crazy because i was hugging the tree i went vegan i just eating fruits for 3 months 4 months only eating fruits raw you know talking about things like that and everybody's like oh my gosh she's crazy Ma- now right now thousands of people are listening to me and they are, they they agree with me what i'm saying what i'm expressing i'm just speaking my heart out and my mind out all day long You see so now right now and then when i was inspiring my family and friends like to eating fruits eating vegetables eating all these like you know do drink lots of water do not eat sugar no gluten these are poison and all this everybody like oh my god this is our food how are we going to survive how can you going to survive you need to eat meat you need to eat eggs you need to eat dairy and all these things like you're going to die otherwise but now do you know how many years it's been 6 years without meat 
and now I inspire those people who used to fear who laugh at me e eating lots of fruits and vegetables even sometimes they go for vegetarian diet and now they tune into my diet it can I can start with my mother I can start with my sister I can start with one of my close friends so this is how it goes from the wing and nobody listen and then they, they it hit you and then you're like wow okay she was right so that is why be the inspiration to others even if they don't believe in you because you believe in yourself I believe in you God believe in you spirits guides believe in you and sisters believes in you angels believes in you so you gotta love yourself all the way mm-hmm so this is it for today please share this video and if you miss my video rewatch it and also you can find more videos on my youtube channel golden spiritual teacher please subscribe and also one more thing share this video and if you want to support donate to my paypal and you can also get angel readings from me and counseling and healing anything that you wonder any questions that you have you can have the answers from the angelic room book your time schedule your time with me on messenger any Anybody that will love to much love namaste I will be back soon <laughs>